Kumusta kayo mga learners? Tayo pa rin ay nasa module 3, lesson 2, identifying and describing the different kinds of quadrilaterals. Square, rectangle, parallelogram, trapezoid, and rhombus. Samahan nyo ako sabay-sabay nating pag-aralan ang ating bagong lesson. Hello my dear learners! You have learned already about describing and illustrating different angles such as right angle, acute angle, and obtuse angle. In this module, you will learn how to identify and describe triangles and quadrilaterals. A triangle is a polygon bounded by three line segments and are grouped according to the length of their sides or by the sizes of the angles. A quadrilateral can be defined as a close two-dimensional shapes which has four straight sides. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to identify and describe the different kinds of quadrilaterals Square, rectangle, parallelogram, trapezoid, and rhombus. This is lesson 2 of module 3, identifying and describing the different kinds of quadrilaterals square, rectangle, parallelogram, trapezoid, and rhombus. Did you enjoy activities in your lesson 1? Well, this time, we will study more about the quadrilaterals. The purpose of this module is to show and help you identify and describe the different kinds of quadrilaterals. Lots of exercises are given for you to understand better about this module. Hannah loves to play puzzles. Her older sister Gail gave her a new wooden house puzzle as a gift for her being a good sister. Hannah was so happy and excited that she immediately picks its parts. She was completely satisfied after she arranged every part of the wooden house puzzle. How many shapes do you see in Hannah's wooden house puzzle? Do all shapes look alike? How many sides have each shape? Do you know that four-sided polygon is called quadrilateral? Trapezoids, parallelograms, rectangles, squares, and rhombus are classified as quadrilaterals. Such figures are also used for creative arts even in drawings, houses, and buildings. We can also find the shape of quadrilaterals in various things around us like in a chessboard, a deck of cards, a signboard, laptop, and television. Do you already know the different kinds of quadrilaterals? If you do not yet know, you don't have to worry about my dear learners. I am here and ready to help you. Are you ready? Let's talk about them one at a time. Quadrilateral is a polygon with four vertices or corners, four sides, and four angles. Here is a list of different types of quadrilaterals with their names, figures, and properties. Number 1. Parallelogram Opposite sides are equal. 
opposite sides are parallel. Opposite angles are equal. Number 2. Rhombus. All sides are equal. Opposite angles are equal. Number 3 is rectangle. Opposite sides are parallel. Opposite sides are equal. All angles are equal and measures 90 degrees. Number 4. Square. All sides are equal. All angles are equal and measures 90 degrees. Number 5. Trapezoid. Has only one pair of opposite sides that are parallel. Adjacent angles add up to 180 degrees. Identify the following quadrilateral. Write your answer in your answer sheet. Let us check. Supply the missing words or numbers to complete the statement. Choose your answer inside the box. Write your answer in your mathematics notebook. A polygon with four sides and four angles is called quadrilateral. A parallelogram that has four equal sides and opposite angles are equal is called Rhombus. A rectangle is a parallelogram that has equal right angles. Each of its opposite side is blank. A blank has two pair of parallel sides and its opposite sides are equal. A square is a parallelogram that has blank equal sides and blank right angles. A blank has only one pair of opposite sides that are parallel. Write your answer in your mathematics notebook. Describing quadrilateral. Complete the table. Give the name and properties of each figure. Letter A, that is rhombus. Rhombus has... 4 equal side. Letter B, parallelogram. Parallelogram has two pairs of parallel sides and its opposite side are equal. Write your answer in your mathematics notebook. Answer the following questions. A. How many equal sides does an isosceles triangle have? B. How many equal sides does an equilateral triangle have? C. What kind of angle does an acute triangle have? D. What kind of angle does a right triangle have? And E, what kind of angle does an obtuse triangle have? Draw your own triangles according to sides and angles and name it. One is done for you. You can use different sizes. Do it in your notebook. Name and match the quadrilateral with its definition. Do it in your answer sheet. Number 1. All sides are of the same length and there are four right angles. That is letter E. And letter E is a square. Number 2. There is only one pair of parallel sides. Letter C. And letter C is a trapezoid. 
Then, it's your time to answer number 3, 4, and 5. Draw your own robot using different types of quadrilaterals. Do it in your answer sheet. And here's the rubrics for drawing a robot. Marami salamat sa inyong pananood. Hanggang sa susunod, hanggang sa muli. Paalam! Huwag kalimutan mag-subscribe, like, comment, and share.